Hey dudes, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to add a video background in DVD Styler. So we are in this project which is Twin Road Peak DVD and I made a movie which is Twin Road Peak and I want this to have a video background. Always remember that you need to set the background when you double click on the menu on the menu properties that it's still black. So we need to prepare the video first. So we will prepare the video in Movie Maker. So in Movie Maker, I'm going to show you how to make something loopable in Movie Maker. Rather than trying to have some inconsistent looping all around. But first off, I want this to be silent. So I'm going to Video Tools, Edit. As the video is selected, remember that. And let's go to Video Volume, click that, and drag it down until it's silent. So when I play this, let's hit space and doesn't have sound. Now we will add a visual effect so it can fade out to white and fade into white or fade out to black and fade out into black. So I'm going to choose more, click that and click multiple effects. And I'm going to fade out to black and fade in from black by double clicking them and now these effects will be applied and click apply and when I play this it fades in from black and fades out to black now let's export this video to home I'm going to save movie I'm going to choose a custom setting which I usually use new video I'm going to Make it WMV because apparently WMV is better on DVD style for some reason. And I'm going to name it uh, DVD background. And save. Now the video background is ready. I'm going to close this and also close the project. Now I'm not going to save. If you want to save the project just in case, you can always save it. But I'm not going to save it, so I'm going to click no. So back in the DVD styler, I'm going to double click on the menu, on the blank space in the menu. And I'm going to click this ellipsis button. I'm going to find the video background. I'm going to choose this, and I'm going to check the loop, because I want the video to loop back and forth. So I'm going to click OK. And if, as you can see, it doesn't really show the background unless I actually render it. So let's do burn render it. Let's click burn. Just make sure that I preview this and I'm going to create an ISO as well. Click start. And the preview will start using VLC portable. And it opens and look at it. <laughs> it's a video background on DVD Styler. And if I'm satisfied with the video background, I can always create it to an ISO and ready to get burning. Or if I'm not, I'm just going to click no. That's about it. That's how to make a video background in DVD Styler. I'm New Creator. See you later.